on the day of Gogol's death by Nikolai Nekrasov, who blessed the good-natured poet with little bile and much emotion, or lovers of a gentle art sent him sincere greetings. The admiration of a crowd sounds in his ear like rippling waves. He is a stranger to self-doped, the tortures of creative souls. Love of comfort and tranquility shining audacious satire. He firmly dominates the crowd with his peace-loving liar. He is not cursed nor driven out, but worshipped for his splendid mind, while all his countrymen prepare a monument to him in life. But fate will show no mercy to one whose noble genius has led him to unmask the crowd, expose its passions and mistakes. His heart a brim with hate, his lips all clad in satire, he wanders down a phony path as rough or liar in hand. He is wild at every step, he catches sounds of admiration, not in sweet murmurings of praise, but in white cries of enmity. With disbelief and new belief in his high calling's dream, he preaches love to all for venomous denial. His speech is every syllable and gain just for him cruel foes, and all men that are smart dull are quick to vilify him. They curse at him from every side, and only when they see his corpse and understand how much he did, and that in hate he was yet full of love.